Welcome to Grade 5 Science Class. Today, we're going to discuss how light interacts with the different materials through a short comic strip. Good afternoon, class. Good afternoon, Teacher Mai. Today's lesson is about how do lights interacts with the different materials and how light can be blocked, absorbed, and transmitted by the certain materials. Okay, take a look at the picture. This is a rainbow. This is a result of the refraction and reflection of white light from the sun through the water droplets in the atmosphere. Okay, take a look at the picture again. This is what we call the stained glass. This can be seen in churches, art museum, and even in some houses. They are glasses with various colors and the light that gets through it it highlights the different colors. Okay, sun is the primary source of light. Do you have any idea what is a visible light? Yes, Don Carl. Visible light is the light that is visible to human eye. Okay. Visible lights allows us to see the color that is not absorbed by the object. Okay, take a look at the picture. We see plants as green because they absorb all the colors of light except for one, which is the green. We have to study further how light interacts with different objects. And the scientific study is called optics. Do you have any idea what is an optics? Yes, June Mark. Optics is the study of reflection, re refraction, absorption, and transmission of light. Good answer, June Mark. Take a look at the picture. This is what we call refraction. This refers to the bending of light as it passes through the different material. So this is the bending of light. Refraction. Again, take a look at the picture. This is what we call reflection. It refers to the bouncing back of light when it hits an object. So, reflection is the bouncing back of light. So, absorption. Take a look at the picture. This refers to a material taking in of light not reflecting it back. So, absorption meaning absorbs being all the colors of light. Transmission. Take a look at the picture. This refers to the passing of light through some materials. Take a look at the transparent, the translucent, and the opaque. So, there are different ways of transmitting light. One is the transparent materials. This allow all light to pass through. And number two, the translucent materials. This is also allow some light to pass through. And number three is the opaque materials. This do not allow light to pass through. 
So, can you give me an example of transparent objects? Yes, June Mark. Transparent objects such as clear plastics and glass windows. Correct, June Mark. Now, can you give me an example of a translucent object? Yes, Jerian. Mom, stained glasses and frosted windows are example of a translucent objects. Very good, Jerian. How about opaque objects? Can you give me an example? Yes, Don Carl. Mom, concrete walls, uh, wooden doors, and mirrors are example of translucent objects. Very good, Don Carl. Okay, take a look at the flow chart. Light can be visible light. And the visible light can be reflection, refraction, transmission, and absorption. And under the transmission, there are three ways of transmitting light. Through a transparent, translucent, and opaque materials.